Hey everyone, it's Char from Char's Fashion Nation. It's partially warm out today, but whatever. Um, so yesterday you might just be wondering why I'm sitting over here. Because yesterday I had the chance to like go run a little errand. And there was this lady at the Rite Aid, right? Like she uh, was trying to figure out like how to do the eye look that I had on, which I will try to insert um, somewhere along in this video. And I was telling her, you know what? How about if I just do a video about how I did that look, okay? It's how I did the eye look and everything else. So, I, Elf don't make my shade no more. This is what I got left. Um... So, I went with Wet n Wild. There's this close enough to that. Close enough. Because people ain't really, like, having my shade no more. Whatever. So, I also picked up this foundation stick. So, we will go with this. I couldn't find any eye primer. Like, right now... This is the only buy that I can do because, like, look, I have had a breakout. Oh my gosh, this is yellow. Yellow is not my skin undertone. Okay, so basically, I would just put a, a face primer on and then come on, foundation brush. And then put that on maybe the other foundation will help tone down the yellow. So now we're all used to the pump like these, right? These are great and everything, but these from Wet n Wild have the little spatula thingy, right? So the palette that I used was Lurella. I have to say I love the formula. I am glad that I have it. Ooh, I have to say like now because Jersey weather's been freaking weird lately. And uh, if you guys want to know, powwows this weekend. Um, so, you girl got to get ready for powwow. I bought some hair color. I don't think you can. No, you can't see the boxes sitting over there. So, I don't know. In the light here, instead of on camera, it doesn't really look like yellow. And it cost about the same as the elf for this. So I'm just going to go ahead and do this. So, yeah. And then if you want, you can take a beauty blender and whatever and just mat this down. Like, you can go ahead and do that. Because this must be making everything look glossy. So, what can we do to tone that down is to take the Gerard Cosmetics um, Pink Blurring Powder. I love this stuff. Sometimes it's on sale. $29. I know. But I got it when I had a little, little extra. And I told Jen Gerard that I would get it and try it out. Because I have that pinkish pink peachy pink undertone is what I'm trying to get out of my mouth there. Can you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? Oh my gosh. See the difference? Like you got this and then like pow. Oh, what a big difference, right? Now I told her about this blurring powder and you see what I just did there? 
like not only did I just put that under the eye, but you can also take it and just go like this. So it just mats it down so you don't have that shiny oil look to the face. And basically that just took it all, all off. So, and I also do this. Like you can blur your pores all day with this stuff. I don't care what part of your face it is. This is what I do. I don't know, maybe I'll end up sending Gerard Cosmetics an extra customer after this video. So anyway, I told the lady, I'm like, you know, like I was saying, that I would do a video. So this is that video. So anyway, take a blending brush. Mine just happens to be the Believe Cosmetics from the Dollar General. And just go like that. Okay, you're like, but what about your eyebrows? I always have a trick for that. Let me find that brush. I still have my brushes in this. I do like this thing. If I am on like a point where, you know, like, I just want to do my makeup real quick, right? I take this. I said I would show. Take a brush like this, or you could take a small flat brush. Roll it. Just rolling, rolling. <laughs> Watch. Kind of. Makes a difference. Like, my eyebrows um, are black, but sometimes they turn, like, this brown tone. And just go like this. And I also have the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, eye, eyebrow pomade, the pomade. So I have that. I do use it, but just... On some days where I'm just in a hurry and I just happen to have, or I pull out the Crim Shop um, one that I have. If you don't know, I got those from Mary Catherine Loves Cats. She is such a sweetheart. I'll leave her a link. Um, absolutely. So, okay, so that's how I get the eyebrow down now. Don't forget to leave this brush out. And I will show you why. And then now I'm just going to show you how I did that look out of here. Um, find my brush, my elf brush, which has lasted me for about five years, four or five years. So now the first thing I did was I went in... Yeah, I went in here, actually. I went in here. I didn't go in the gray. I, I just went straight to this. Now, if you see what I do, is I lightly take the brush and go like this. Don't, don't scrub it. And if you see what I just did there, I pat that on. Pat that on. All you have to do, and look at that. You know what this is a substitute for a dupe is the um, Juvia's Place, the little quad palette with all the uh, gray shades in it. So again, take it like this and keep your blending brush on hand because you're going to need your blending brush for this. Our eyes will never turn out the same. That's just how this goes. It's reality. <laughs> Take a blending brush. Now, it's going in a circle. 
but she says her son's wedding is this weekend coming up and she could not figure out how to do a smoky look for her son's wedding. She's the MOB. No, she's not an MOB. She's the MOG, mother of the groom. Okay, so do not be afraid to take it up towards the eyebrow. Okay, and then I went in here Just all over that lid so that you know you don't have to be afraid to do this because you can turn out some really like awesome smoky looks um, so now this after we blend Um, we will pick this brush back up and then we're going to go back into that black right here. No eyeliner is necessary. See that? No eyeliner is necessary for that. Um, basically, I mean, you got this and bam, you got that. So, and right there at the edge, just right there, there's this eye, there's this eye, <laughs> again, and this look actually does not take all that long. And we'll blend this in a minute, but can you guys like a look at how I did that look? So I know that I have more things coming up this week. Um, the Brood Beauties collaboration on Wednesday. And we will be doing a uh, Gemini look. Or if you're a Battlestar Galactica fan original, that would be Gemini's. <sighs> so, okay. Now, I also went right in here, but I also took the white, okay? Take that white and just kind of pat that right there. And then we'll take the blending brush to it. And we're going to take this. And just apply that right there. That's all you that's all you need for that. Just a little pat of it. And now we're back to the blending brush. So blend that. And then don't rub this, just kind of pat it. And that's basically what I did because like yesterday I didn't even put any mascara on. Um, but I will show you how I did my uh, contouring. You have different brown shades in here. Um, Everybody is a different shade of tan. That's how I feel. Because everybody has a different shade. That's what makes it so gosh darn difficult to find your shade of makeup. I'm going in this one. Now, I do have the Too Faced Cosmetics um, palette for doing um, your contour. I just I haven't pulled that out to use it lately. So, we'll go back in with that brush the believe brush don't be afraid to go over to the dollar general and look at makeup and hair color over there if they have your hair color they do not have mine 
They had colors that I didn't want for everybody else. But whatever. I'm not mad at that. Because people are people. So there was that. Now the other thing I can say when you do a lip. Because like mine yesterday. Yo, that was great. So let me show you something else that I did. Was I went into this. So let's say you may want to, this is the Fenty Beauty. If you want to add a little bit of this, just a little bit, right over that, you get kind of this golden um, pink. So that's now kind of a golden pink color. These are awesome. Another thing I got from Mary Catherine. Now I got the Too Faced one from uh, from Ann, from Just Ann. And I'm going to put this. I learned this from Jari. It's spelled Yari, but it's pronunciated, I believe, Jari. It's not a jarring thing to go watch her. I gotta go up there and catch up on her videos. So I just put this over here with my other stuff. And at this point, what I would do, you can use your your Slay All Day Setting Spray from Gerard Cosmetics. Like this lady had never heard of Gerard Cosmetics. <laughs> I was like, what? What? You've never heard of Gerard Cosmetics? No, some people don't know because they're not online like that. Um, it's the wrong one. Here we go. Um, some people aren't online like that to, to know what's actually out there. So I'm going to show you a better way to do the lip I did yesterday. That way it comes out better because yesterday I just felt like that was circus clown. It's kind of circus clown-ish. Um, and then this is from Koki Cosmetics, which she was standing in front of that. Sorry, that was shaking. That's L. And there it is. It be hiding. Yes, I've lost more weight. In the waist, my hips are just. I've got a big butt. <laughs> Like, she was wondering, like, is Koki new? Yeah, actually. So, we have that on. You see what I mean? Like, it's kind of circus clown. We don't want that. Hold on a minute. I forgot to get something to block my slip. So let me get that. Remember to block your lips. That is important. Yes, I still get up out of a chair like I used to when I was in a wheelchair. It's just a habit. So take it. Blot. Blot. You're like, wait, that just took it off. No, it didn't. It lightened it up is what that did. Now, here's the step I didn't do yesterday and probably should have. We can go into the shade here, right next to that white shade. Let me come a little closer. And um,
that makes a difference. I know that looks weird, but that looks a little better. There we go. <laughs> And that's why I put my arm up like that. Okay, so there's that. Let me put my hair down. Um, so basically that's what I did. Um, obviously I used e.l.f. yesterday. Um, use what you like for your skin tone. I mean, she's, you know, trying to tan. Um, not all white people can tan, but you know what? That's okay because you're fine the way you are. That's just my thing. I think people are fine the way they are. Like, it is nice to be natural tan. This is true. You know how long it would take me to brush all this forever? And I don't mind that, but... All I did was just have my hair pulled back in a ponytail yesterday. Oh my gosh, today, like allergy, allergies. So you can also use a clear setting powder or you can use like a pink blurring powder like I just showed you. And this is the lip I should have done yesterday instead of like that crazy clown lip. Oh my gosh, anybody else out there having like your allergies are all like, blah. Oh yeah, there was something I was going to show my friend Velvet, Velvet Solis. Go check her out. I'll leave her linked. Um, the, oh, I'll just grab the bottle. This is the brand of skincare that I use. Um, this is the vitamin C. Also, if you're watching, the lady that I ran into yesterday, if you're watching, I use the vitamin C. And I use the rose hip. They have this at the Rite Aid. That's where I got it. I haven't used it all up. Yeah, <laughs> I haven't used it all up. If you've seen that video, if you know, you know, I got this in a uh, sample box of these. Sometimes samples go a long way. I would say this would be almost like a deluxe sample because um, it's lasted me. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And of course, so the lady knows, you can't mistake my tattoos either. My medicine bag. In which I had on. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this and understand like now how more you can do this and not have to worry about it. Uh, because what was funny yesterday after I left the Rite Aid, she's like, I hope to see you around. She was at the grocery store, and I'm like, we got to stop running into each other like this. She's like, are you following me? And I'm like, no, are you following me? <laughs> it's funny. But anyway, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed. I have a lot of stuff to do this week. So I will see you in the next one. But if you really want to put this pink shade in there on your lip do like I did with this you can do that isn't that kind of pretty though it's kind of pretty anyway have a great Monday bye